Okay, Terry, we're going to do a quick review here of how I want you to upload the reports. So, the reports look good. I didn't make any changes on this one, so uh, everything was good. A nice house here, actually. So, let me, um, so what we want to do is we want to go over, so, let's, um, this is it here. So there it is. I went through all of these. They look good. So we're going to just do a upload. Okay. Click on full report for upload or print. Okay. And then we want to make sure we get the right heading here. So we're going to go to home inspection. Okay. And We'll have to, I'll have to get on your computer to make sure all the settings are right before you start doing it. But I'm just going to send this to you as a, uh, you know, the, uh, as a one you can keep uh, for your file. And when you go back, you'll be able to look at this. So anyways, get your home inspection. So if it was just a, a commercial property, you'd click here. If it was a home inspection here, if it was a molding testing here, if it was a roof inspection here, if it was... Well inspection, you know, septic and well, but a home inspection would cover home septic well and everything else, you know. So we'll go home inspection, click there. Okay, uh, make sure your settings are right. Okay, and then we're going to hit OK. I'll hit OK here, and it's going to be right there it is. Okay, so a nice cover photo, looks good. All these photos are looking good. Yeah. Jimmy looking good. Yeah, pretty clean place here. Oh, this picture is too big here. Okay, we got to downsize that. So let's cancel. Go into electrical. And that was the, I think this is it. Yeah, he had it at medium. Should be small. Probably would blew it up to take a look at it or something. Who knows? Anyways, so let's go back. Make sure all your pictures is all right, the right sizes. Okay. Good. Thank you. Overview picture here is good. Great. Okay, very good. So we're going to go to upload. I'm going to upload this to your home gauge. Okay, then once that's done cycling there. Okay. Well, here it's, it's coming. There it is. Okay, so hit yes. Okay, so here it is here. So these are yours here. So we're going to go to viewing. Make public. Click on this link here. Copy that link. Right click copy. Hit yes to make public. Okay, then we got report number is 22213. So we need to go to ISN 22213. So I got it in here. You can search for it. Okay, so um, what we want to do first of all is we want to um, go over here. You can click on this little blue dot here to load the report, or you can go to this information dot, go to actions. 
upload report provide a report URL home inspection and then paste that link that you copied right there and then set report URL so now ready and that should pop it in there good and there it is home inspection great okay and then um, there's Kyle so we always want to make sure we got a picture of the realtor the buyer's agent because we send it to the buyer's agent too so a couple things we need though is we need the invoice to be downloaded and we need a cover photo so um, let me just go show you where the invoice is action here's the invoice okay and the invoice is paid and so we're just gonna download it okay and it's gonna go to your download file see it's spinning up here in the corner and then down here it's gonna drop down here there it is so now you can close it out the invoice is 17 290 okay so we're gonna go to action upload the attachment the invoice if we want to find the invoice we're going to go 17 290 is the invoice so we're going to copy that open and then it's going to there it is this is how you put in your attachment so upload selected file good now there's your attachment so all right so let's go back over here okay so here it is there's the report right there it's been up it's up there so if you click on that it's it's going to show you the report there it is so let's go back um, the other thing I want to do is I want to put the cover photo in here. So to re you're going to go to get, click on that little house there. Okay. And then we're going to go find, um, return to order and set property photo here. So we want to go find it. So I'm going to find it under your report number here. Okay. 22, 213. You can find it there or you can find it at, um, in your photo file either way, but I usually will just go to here. 22 to 13 so select photo file so I gotta go to home gauge home gauge where's my home gauge report reports and then what was that number 22 to 13 22 to 13 so wait there it is so open that up there's your cover photo click on that and hit OK And now your cover photo should be in there. So let's go back to view inspections. I want to make sure it's there when you get it. There it is. So good. So this is ready to roll. Very good. So now you, we just want to go ahead and send it. So you can go, you can click here, email inspection report. Here's your attachment of your invoice. There's the invoice and notes. And, but we can go over here to the blue dot there and actions email report okay we're going to email it to the client we're going to email the uh, kyle and then we'll email it to you on a bb bcc so you can see what it looks like and then just hit send report and they're going to get that and you'll see what that looks like in fact i'm going to put mine down then we're going to take a look at that Oop, that's not my email Com. Okay, so I'm sending it to myself here. Okay, good. So we'll go back to view inspections. So hit that blue dot again. Then we're going to go down here. You'll see where the reports have been sent out. So when when they view it, it's going to be turned green. So that's how we know that they viewed it is when it turns green. Okay. So uh, we can go back to home gauge now. Where's home gauge? Yeah. Well, here's home gauge. So we go to view inspection, view uploaded reports. Okay, so now because it was paid for, we can send it out in home gauge. So we first we send it out in ISN, then we send it out again in home gauge. But we only send it out in home gauge if it's been paid. If it hasn't been paid, when you send it out in ISN, it's going to ask them to make payment for the inspection before they can view the report. And once payment is made, could be a day later, two days later. Hopefully, it would be right afterwards. But then you can go in and send it from HomeGage. 
But now that we know it's already paid, we can go to HomeGate, send emails, click here, click here to forward so we can get these, and then these two are already clicked here. We can send emails. Okay, so now it's gonna they're gonna get it both ways. They're gonna get it from HomeGage and from ISN. So that's that's what we're doing there. So that's that. We can go back to ISN. Okay, and so there's what you got going on here. So that looks good. That's that's all done there. So let me um just kind of show you why we got this video going here. Uh, how to change your heading so you want to get like your septic and well inspection I don't know what you have in yours so I would have to take a look but you would go to office doc um, edit report docs right there then you're gonna have a cover so we got cover home so I can just I can make a you know something I can take that okay hit okay I can change this to say, um, you know, for instance, I can just say home inspection report, or I could say well inspection or whatever, and then go to save as, okay, and then you want to name it, cover, space, dash, space, home inspection report, okay, let me, I'm going to change it to this, um, I'm just going to, not that I would ever use this, but so you'll see the difference duplex inspection report okay so go to save as so I already got septic and well and well and I got all those already in there so so you're gonna take your main inspection report then you're gonna change it and then save as and then we're gonna name it cover space dash space du duplex inspection report and then you hit okay okay now it's done so we're going to hit close it out and save current file yes okay so now when we go back into office docs you'll see um i created a duplex right here there it is so i just created a new cover page with that title so let me just close it out here and let me just do this so so what you would do is go to so you say, say you're ready to upload it now. Go to upload, go to edit, and then over here, this line right here, this box right here, you click on that, go down, and you find cover. I'm going to change it to duplex. Okay, and then hit OK. Hit OK, OK. And then you'll see the cover page change to duplex up here. Okay, so let's cancel that out. We're going to go back. We're going to upload and we're going to change it back to home inspection report right here right here and then hit open hit OK hit OK and you'll see it says inspection report now so that's how you create a heading you just take the cover page and you can change it name it whatever you want save it and it'll be there okay um, and the other only other thing is you, you want to make sure that it's a uh, when you go over here to edit other you should always be in HTML you might be in PDF very seldom will you print it in a PDF um, basically if it's a pay at closing you could do a PDF okay we don't do very many pay at closing so we don't we don't deal with this but if you did you would just go to okay and okay You'll see it's a little different format when it comes in the PDF. So let's downsize it here to 100. Let's go 75. Yeah. So this is what your report looks like. Okay. Let's go down a little bit more. 50. Okay. So there's your report. That's in a PDF. All right, and so all that looks great. Nice, nice report. So, anyways, that's how you would do that. Let's cancel that out. So we want to get your settings back, though. So we got to go back to upload. Print report for upload. Edit. 
go to other let's change it back keep it on html and most you know 99.9% .9 of the time you're going to send it off from html okay there it is all right so i think that's a wrap they're doing a great job and um yep can't wait to uh we get together and do that uh presentation for uh keller williams so anyways take care terry and i'll talk to you later